When the contact centre at Invicta House Maidstone isn't decorated in red and receiving donations, it is used to provide council-related support such as social services and highways. We're normally busy. I mean, we, um, we basically handle, well, it ranges between four and 6,000 calls a day. We have uh, about 130 people who are all sort of working in the contact centre to, to handle those calls. And uh, yeah, and as I said, we're always open, so even uh, sort of Christmas Day, there'll always be somebody here taking, taking your call. Plenty of preparations took place to transform the site into a comic relief call centre to take donations across the county. Lots of uh, things have been happening to get the centre ready for uh, the event. Got lots of t shirts printed for all of the, uh, the people who are coming to uh, sort of sit down and take, take the calls. We've also organised lots of things for the um, people to provide food and drink uh, because there are over 100 people who are going to be working uh, here up until midnight. So basically need lots of uh, food and, and drink to keep, keep them going really. So there's lots of local businesses who have donated, uh, donated all of that. Lots of systems work, so we've got all of the uh, computers need to be uh, configured so that they can take the, on, the, the actual donations and that information then gets sent off to Comic Relief. Around 130 volunteers attended along with comedian Joe Pasquale. I've been asked to come and uh, sit uh, by the phones and take the donations tonight and because I only live around the corner, what's say around the corner, I don't mean in the prison, I mean in Rochester, so it's just a quick trip for me to come down here and uh, I think at the moment, present you know, crisis that everybody's in with financially, the world, uh, everything needs, uh, especially charities, are the first things that suffer, so um, it's now I'm giving up a few hours to come down here answering the phones. Approximately 3,000 calls were taken from 7pm until midnight, which raised around £125,000. OK, fantastic. Thank you very much for donating today. Bless you. Thank you. Bye-bye. I've never done anything like this before, so it's a whole new thing to me. I've got a computer at home, but I use it as a nightlight. So uh, I don't know how this works yet, but I've got a bloke here standing by that's looking over my shoulder all the time that's going to help me uh, if I get in trouble. It's not a case of if, it's just a case of when. <laughs> <laughs>